you know, this is I'm reading so much about cops shooting people and people shooting people and people shooting each other. And it's just, look, it's got to stop guys. I mean, we can protest and we can try to get our message across with running out and shooting everybody. I mean, I know people have been shooting people for years, but it just seems like it's increased now. Let me just jump into the editorial and give you an idea of what I'm talking about. Thank you to Dallas Fort Worth CBS local for this story. The investigation continues into finding who shot at four officers while they were helping victims of a traffic accident at the intersection of John West Road and La Prada Drive. The shooting happened on October 31st at 6.58 p.m. Two Dallas police officers along with two Mesquite officers, all in uniform, were targeted, according to Dallas Police Association President Mike Mata. Mike Mata said, quote, They were waiting on a wrecker and directing traffic when all of a sudden bullets are coming their way. Immediately following the initial shot, four to five additional shots were fired and the officers took cover and called for backup. And the officers were able to safely run toward the area of the gunshots in an attempt to locate the suspect or suspects. And as officers were running, they heard screaming coming from 8300 La Prada Drive. Mata said a 19-year-old, believed to be the gunman, was found and arrested for unlawful carrying of a weapon. His gun is now being tested to see if it was indeed the weapon used in the shooting. Mike Mata said, quote, If it comes through attrition that this is the individual that fired those rounds at officers, it absolutely was intentional. And unfortunately, it's a narrative that's being carried across the country by a very small percentage but vocal amount of people. He said across the country, there's several recent examples of unsuspecting officers targeted for no reason. Mike Mata said, The protest that we've had in the past, we've had individuals that were throwing bricks. What happened in New Orleans with the officer that was shot in the face doing nothing but sitting in a squad car? This narrative that the police are the public's enemy has to stop because it is not true. Mata said not only is this causing significant stress for officers and their families, but it's taking a toll on mental health. The Dallas Police Association's Assist the Officer Foundation provides confidential counseling to officers and their families. Mata said in the last three years, demand for services has increased more than 200 percent. So, you know, here you have these officers that now are the stress is there because somebody's coming. Who's that over there? Ooh, you know, now we know why they're putting their flashlight in our face. And I don't mind the old flashlight. Oh, OK, you know, I don't. That's fine when cops do that. I know what they're doing. It's when they go like this to you and your camera. And you're like, dude, what the fuck are you doing? Put that thing away, you know? But when they do this, hmm. you know, they're just seeing who you are. I get that. But the stress is there, and that's what's causing them to do that. Cops are like, whoa, hair in the back of the neck. Somebody's over here. Oh, oh, he's got a camera. That's what they should be saying, but they're stressed out. It's stressing us out, too, as cop watchers, because we're out there, and what if they think we're somebody and they shoot at us? A camera guy already got shot by the cops, a newsman. Remember when that happened? And he goes, you know me. You shot me, but you know me. There's stress on both sides. And people say, why do you have to cop watch? Because of some of the editorials I give where the cop says, well, this happened and this happened. And then you get the body camera footage and it's nothing like what the cop said. It's like, not what the fuck you said. You said this. You know, so if I'm recording the cops at that time, my camera tells the truth right away so when they do their police reports it's like well jimmy we got his footage um uh, deputy alcala you know the riots august 1st girl punched him right in the back she could have been like i didn't punch you no what are you talking about who no i you must have ran into me but no my camera showed her run up to him and go mm, mm, and then run off um but you see what I'm saying, though? If my camera hadn't captured that footage, nobody else got it. Everybody else was like, oh, my God, oh, my God. And the cameras were going all over the place. I saw her running up while well, I was watching him anyway to see him making an arrest. And I saw her run up and do that. And I went, she just punched that cop. And I was waiting for her to get arrested. I don't know where if she disappeared or what. But my point is. 
that's why we're filming. But as well, these law enforcement officers should know. I'm trying not to get off point. These law, off, law enforcement officers should know we've got as much, almost as much stress as you guys do. You know, they say, well, you're not targeted, though. People aren't trying to shoot you. Oh, yeah, I've seen cop watchers. Uh, people just walk up, these bootlickers come up and just start punching on cop watchers, knocking their camera out of their hand. Oh, we're out there just like you in the midst of it. You start getting shot at, guess where the cop watcher's at? <laughs> right there, buddy. So we're under just as much stress as you are. Well, you don't have to cop watch. Actually, we do, because if we're not out there, then you get... Um, you know, where, where something happens and a cop writes his report up. I've done editorials where they write their report up and then the cop's body camera comes out and they go, hold on, look at this cop's body camera. Look at his report. That's not what the fuck happened. What? Hey, man, what did, you, did you even watch your own body camera back when you did your report? You know, it's like, um, who's that officer? I just did an editorial on it and he's being charged with falsifying reports because he's report didn't match the body camera at all um so yeah it's important for us to be out there no we don't have to be out there but we do have to be out there what's the fix you guys let me know in the comment section what the fix is i don't even know if i understand this editorial i'm trying to make sense of it thank you guys link to this stories in the comment uh, Link to this story is in the description box below. Community Leo Watch, watching Leos, that's law enforcement officers, to include those getting shot at at the highway from coast to coast.